Hey guys, we are back for part two of my Minecraft series. And, um, just as a quick reminder, I'm keeping them rather short to, I believe, seven minutes is the longest I made it, which was the last one. But, um, if you didn't see the last episode, definitely go check it out. I'll, um, I'll put a link in the description to it. And, um, just as a summary of last episode, we, um, I built a house on the ice, and uh, it's it's very rather beautiful, if I were to say so myself. It's very beautiful. I I couldn't have done it without my fans, my few fans that I have. I love them. Um. So, I'm not sure what I have planned to do in this game right now, but um. I'm hoping to definitely get my set of tools and to try to start mining, maybe. But you never know. Just getting some more wood, because I only had one piece of plank left. And um, I think I'll replace the ice floor with just wooden planks. That would probably be good. Never know when there could be global warming and my floor would melt. That would just kind of be bad. Let's plant these saplings just to have more trees pop up. Why not? I think I might uh, make a farm out on the ice because it's basically just surrounded by water. That would be cool. Okay. Get back to my house because the sun I think it's going down soon. Um. Okay. Okay. Dun 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 dun. Okay, let's make a bed so we don't have to wait the whole night. Let's, and then let's make our four planks. made a house like this on the ice before. I personally think it's a pretty good idea because you're um, somewhat isolated. Uh, well, I chose to be kind of close to the land so I wouldn't have to run too far, but um, either way, I think it's working out good so far. Guess we'll find out if I wake up and there's an arrow in my head. sleep. Let's make... S oh, where I have some sticks. There's a wooden pickaxe. Now let's make a sword. Then let's make some more sticks. Now let's make an axe. Then how about a spade, shovel, whatever, I'm sorry. And I'm going hungry. Oh, I don't need a potato right now. Not a potato, just... Let's go mine some stuff. Hold on, I'm gonna go kill that pig to get some food. <laughs> Come here, piggy. Oh, nice. And it did it disappear? It's terrible. There's no bueno. You don't disappear on me, bro. Oh, hey, no, it didn't. Alright. Let's... 
basically, I guess, I guess we'll just basically dig down to get to the stone. Because why not? Um, up again since I ate that since I brutally murdered some animals and ate them very humane if you ask me okay let's do this until we get a stack of stone or until my pickaxe breaks Let's see here. at the stack. Does it break at 64? Oh, it breaks at 60. What a troll. Okay. Whoa, we ran like super fast. Whoa. That's cool. Let's get some... Hold on, let's make a furnace first. There we go. Hot topic. Because, you know, we're, we're cool like that. Okay. Just make that so we don't go straight into our wood, our stone pickaxe. Then let's go get some more wood from this mighty fine looking tree. Paul Bunyan chopping down this tree. That was Paul Bunyan chopped down trees, right? I have no idea. Yes, Nate. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Just out of nowhere. <laughs> Sorry, uh, it's for some weird reason I always get Paul Bunyan and Paul Revere mixed up. <laughs> I don't know how. Maybe because the name is Paul. Alright, I would say that's a good amount of wood, but let's just get this last tree. Oh my god! What? I just spawned like 250 people or something, like a lot of people, and then I brought out the minigun. Jeez. Oh hey, there's a cow over there. That's cool. Okay, guys, I'm going to end this clip right here. Um, thank you for watching this, and the next clip will start very soon. Thank you.